all sun exposure, whether it's summer or winter, uh, have the same effect on the skin. And again, it comes down to how much damage occurs. And that means, yes, you can get a sunburn in the winter. We're getting less ultraviolet light penetrating through the atmosphere because of the angle of the sun in the sky. So you would need more time for exposure to get the sunburn, but it's certainly possible. As our skin absorbs UVA and UVB, premature aging occurs, no matter what the season. And depending on what is around you, the rays can technically hit you twice. If there's ice or water or snow, then we can also get more intense ultraviolet light just through the rebound and the reflection. When ultraviolet light hits the skin, irrelevant of season, there's a DNA damage that occurs at the level of the skin and then a cycle that occurs. More sun exposure, more damage. And that, that cycle, whether you're in the winter or summer, is cumulative and adds up. Where you live in Canada also plays a role. You may be at a higher risk for a wintertime sunburn in the mountains of BC versus the Ottawa Valley or the lower Great Lakes. And here's why. At higher elevations, there's less atmosphere to absorb ultraviolet radiation. So we might increase actually uh, the ultraviolet intensity by about 10% for every thousand meters that we are at elevation. So certainly the mountains would be an area where we would be more prone to get a sunburn. Preventing burns can be easy. Cover up exposed skin, monitor your time in the sun, and most importantly, wear SPF every day.